Uh, Christopher Maloney can indulge us for just a second. He's live with us from New York City. And uh, Chris, before we get started, I'm going to read the introduction that our producer Grace, who has a crush on you, wrote. <laughs> All right. Uh, Hollywood hunt Christopher Maloney stars on one of the hottest shows on television. And not only does the show keep getting hotter, so does he. And so I thought, all right. It's true. Okay, so I thought that's a little much. And okay. then we pulled up his IMDb thing because we yeah. had that story on IMDb with his piercing blue eyed glint, brawny looks, cocky tough guy stance, and effortless charisma. TV's Christopher Maloney <laughs> drew on a sexy Italian heritage right to grab audiences. Here's the deal. It's that smile. He's saying, what's your point? Uh, I'm saying, Christopher, you can't, it, Christopher you can't see Maloney. us, but here in L.A., Frank and I are seven pluses. Henry, I think, hovering around a nine. Yeah. And we're tired of being, we're tired of being dwarfed Maloney. by you. Fifteen. What's it like to be a 15? Chris, good morning. <laughs> <laughs> you just put an awful lot on my plate. <laughs> <laughs> now, who, 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 wrote, who wrote that? Our producer, Grace Mendoza, has a crush on you out of, of her, her mind. mind. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> and uh, she, in fact, she wants to know how many more seasons uh, are you in? Because the, the fact of the matter is you've had a very long and successful run on this show. So you're to be commended for that. How much longer do you want to do it? Uh, we're, we, we are a dozen years deep uh, into this Isn't experiment. That crazy? Uh, wow. and it's been just uh, an unbelievable ride. Um, you know, as far as uh, continuing on, you know, uh, you know, right now we're just we're, we're discussing, we're negotiating. There are a lot of things happening at, at NBC. Um, you know, I, I think I can speak for my castmates. We're all very happy, uh, very proud of the work we've done. So. You know, we'll see how everything just kind of lays out. You seem in real life like a very upbeat guy. And I don't know if this is the appropriate adjective. There's often, I think, kind of a grim quality to, to the show. Is that a contrast? Because, I mean, uh, Stabler's life is much more serious and, and tough, obviously, I would think, than your own. Oh, yeah, definitely. I mean, you, you, um, you know... <laughs> Number one, it's tough to go uh, to be uh, Holly Go Lightly or Happy Go Lucky uh, on a show that kind of focuses on um, sexual abuse and, and crimes of a sexual na sexual nature. Um, uh, thank you for saying that I seem a little more upbeat. Uh, I like to think so. But you know, one of the things that I told Dick Wolf when I, when I signed on was, you know, I, I just saw this character as a, a little bit more. Pressurized uh, mm. than how he was written. I, I felt as though, you know, he should be, you know, a family guy with a lot of mm -hmm. kids, fairly young for having so many kids. So that's, you know, I think that's a lot of pressure to to put on a, a guy on a detective salary in New York. Uh, you know, and obviously the crimes, the the work that he has to deal with, what he sees every day. You know, kind of adds to that pressure. Uh, you know, maybe home life is not just as. Uh, clean and easy and uh, 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 sanitized, you know, maybe it's just, it's more to real life that, you know, there are issues that he has to deal with both, both personally and, and, you know, things that he has to, he has to grow in. Well, Christopher, to that end, we watch how your character does struggle balancing all of those things. And I'm curious, after 12 years in that midst, talking about really heavy stuff, you've probably developed a mechanism from preventing that from affecting you. Because we know, you know, you, you love kids, you work with them, I'm sure you have a family of your own. How do you not let the storylines affect you as, as a human? You know, we, uh, I'm blessed with a bunch of great castmates, all of whom uh, have a fabulous, wonderful sense of humor. Uh, everyone uh, is a team player. Um, that we uh, all ha share a common gallows humor, uh, so you feel safe with mm. maybe going out of bounds because, you know, it's... Work can get a little stressful, yeah. and you know, not as stressful as the real people. God bless them who do this work, this job, uh, in the real world. Um, but you know, you know, I started this job just being married, and along the way, I had two children, and 
it, there was a little hiccup when I had my own kids because then sure. it was the truth of the matter really was uh, personalized yeah. for me. Yeah. And Christopher, they're, they're pushing you know, us along. Now, but, uh, uh, yeah, you uh, deal with it. You have to deal with it. Uh, I, I, we, we never want to uh, rush you along, but they're rushing us along. New episode of uh, Law & Order SUV uh, tonight at 10 on NBC. And before we say goodbye, stare into that camera, Christopher, and in your deepest, most 15-plus uh, romantic way, <laughs> if you could just say good morning, Grace, and we'll run that.